when Tear Up TV wanted someone to meet Britain's proper naughty geezers. One name sprang to mind. Dire. But then things went horribly wrong. Things had started out great for me. I was a sex symbol. A man about town. A proper jack in a box. And through my TV shows, I'd gained enormous respect in the underworld. Finally, they put a tattoo of my name on my back. It's only cost me 50 quid. That's right. A bullseye. I had friends. I was a face. I had a following. But it was all about to come on top. You're my best officer. Without Dyer's testimony, we won't get Martino Rockus. Any stone he's crawled under, you unearth it. Any tree he's climbed, you chop it down. Any bridge he's built, you blow it up. Any river he's crossed, you walk on it. From Martino Rocos, anytime, any place, anywhere. Martino Rocos, I want diarrhea now. I'm on it. Rocco? Rocco? Hello? But Danny Dyer. I know you're not the maternal type, but you will babysit this prat. With respect, Mum, I might look a bit conspicuous in his company. You won't if you dress like a slut. What do you think? Now that's the business. Saying this is how I roll, Spiegel. It's the way it works, you know what I'm saying? And so now I'm in hiding with a filth in a proper naughty seaside town hide on sea. So I don't get a hide in. The one good thing is, though, I've still got my pal down here, the playboy, Tamasalata. Got your highest eagles on. Tam, what are you doing? Putting a pound out on the machine and trying to win kids' toys. Just some change. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's all right. Yeah, no. well, you know, don't people think we're mugs, you know what I'm saying? So this was normality then. I had a new drum, a new wife. I called her for a scar tea. I need to pass the time on a pound note. So I got myself a job. Two barbecues that have gone on fire, 62. My favourite number, 59. Bill and Ben and Flower Pot Men, they're a bit naughty, 53. Got it, Bugle. Two cucumbers stuck in a sandwich with no tomatoes, 55. Two pound of plum, sweet orange. Yeah, orange. curry, Mr. Ever Boo Boo Bingo. And that's right, the dirty filth. They changed my name. Can you believe it? They changed my name to Danny of Boo Boo. Now, you may think this is a great excuse for a naughty weekend down by the seaside. And you might have a case, but a community down here, they're radio mental. Take Mrs. O'Malley. She's the owner of the place. She's barking, and to be honest with you, she scares the earth a kiss out of me. I'm gonna have to smash one of you lads. But I don't know which one I want to smash. I think you'll have to choose for me. Come on, lads. Time's a ticking. The big one. Ah! If she ain't bad enough, what about Scotty the dog? No, no, 
no, no, no, no, no. What'd I tell you two jerk offs about coming over to my side of the camp? I don't know. I think I said. Do not. You fat bag of crap. And then there's a Miller man, a man so blinded by conspiracy, he thought that John Hurt was just covering up for an ugly brother. Listen, no man, I don't know you, and you must never know me, but things aren't what they seem. What do you mean? One, two, three, four, five. Moon landings, 9-11, why the wife left me. We need allies. So that's it then, me and a Ben and Loonies. I mean, I just want to get back to my normal life. I mean, you can't take the boy out of Essex, but you can take the sex. I'm Danny Dyer. A boo-boo? I'm Danny Abubu. I'm being Danny. He's dire. Hold on a second. Nobody wants to miss the West Ham. Right? Yeah, Dan. Yeah. I feel bad get Whitney on the phone. Whitney? Yeah, Houston. I think we've got a problem. I'm touching cloth. 